Genius. This guy actually hunts with bad breath. The wolf in the picture is called the Ethiopian wolf. It lives in the highlands. It mainly feeds on these rodents. Because there are too many rodents. There's nothing else to eat. It's early morning. The mice are cooking. But they have to watch first. To see if any wolves with bad breath are around. But they don't see any. The odor comes first. Here's another bigger rodent. This one is much fatter than a prairie mouse. If a wolf with bad breath saw this, it would be salivating. Now it's hungry. Moles look strange, but they're very alert, because they can't see very well. So they rarely leave their burrows. The bad breath wolf looks at his little brother and realizes he has a plan. Looks like I'll have to show him the ropes. With charming little steps, quietly approach the mole. The bad-tempered wolf warned the little mouse, Come out if you know what's good for you, or I'll scold you. Though the boy's dog paddle looked familiar, but he's not ready to catch more. It seems he can't do it without a little trick. He stuck his slender mouth into the mole's hole, breathing in and out. The odor soon filled the hole. My goodness, sometimes, even he couldn't stand the smell. The mole is still moving on. It seems the predator needs more patience, so they play a game of time. Now it's all about who has more stamina, because if they're not careful, the mole's life could be in danger. The bad breath wolf stands guard at the entrance to the cave. The little mole keeps poking his head out, watching his every move, but the little guy is getting hungry. It wants to eat the little green grass by the door. This is a great opportunity. Of course, the bad breath wolf won't let it get away with it. It gulps down the mole's dragonfly. The scene leaves the victim's partner speechless. She'll have to think about finding a new boyfriend. It seems that every skill or characteristic has its place.